In this video, we're going to go over how to create usernames in a single format and in a bulk format. In the upper right hand corner on your landing page, you're going to click user. For the single format, we're going to click add. You would type in your user ID. The password you would like to use. And then your password again. And username. Username and user ID is slightly different. Username for this is actually going to be what we would like for it to see. You can customize it or you can put it to be generic. So if you want it to be personalized, you just put in first name and last name. My email. phone number so choose which two and then we're going to go into groups and organizations the way that we're going to make this work is we're going to make this work with organizations and in a, a later video i will explain the differences between groups and users and which and also organizations which one is best so we're going to do simple innovations group and we're going to press ok we leave it as knox managed license staging user is a no android management type is going to be android enterprise and then we do not do a f uh, fully managed with the work profile work profile what that means is, is on your device you have a personal side and a work side and in this instance we're going to leave it to where everything is work we're going to add a tag and we'll press ok like I mistyped the password. Once everything is in alignment, you're going to get save. We're going to save the user. Now we now have SIG 100 in here. To bulk import these, we're going to bulk add, click the word download template. And you're going to get what you can create and change. So inside of here, as you see, I've already created all my user IDs, all my passwords. Username would be full name. Our AD is going to be a one. Our organization code, this is where um, I'll go over in more detail in another video for organization codes. But for now, we're just going to put company root. Email. Country code will be US. You put individualized phone numbers in here or generic, as you see here. Required passcode reset one. And then Android uh, Android activation is the Android Enterprise or AE for short. What I will then do is then find the file. Once I find the file, then we will be able to go from there. And then we would press OK and upload. As you see, I already have my users in here. Once the users are in here, they're completely set. We can then make sure that we have the devices going to the correct organization that we'd like. Again, I will talk about that in a later video. To be able to remove a user, if I check the box here, I can modify it. I can change organization type. Or if I check on it, I can then click delete and that user is now gone. That is how you add users singly and also bulk import and update them. 